up at like 5 a.m. I'm not gonna wake up for that. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah. I stayed, I stayed, I was knocked out. My mom came and woke me up and I was like half asleep, like oh. Billie Eilish is an American singer and songwriter. She is best known for her successful debut single, Ocean Eyes. Belonging to a family of musicians, she was destined to make a career in performing arts. She joined a choir at the age of eight, and by the time she turned 11, she had begun writing and singing her songs. Billy performed the song and released it online. It became a massive success. This turned out to be her first massive breakthrough. In 2017, her brother helped her record the single Bellyache. With the success of the song, Billy released her debut EP, Don't Smile At Me, in August 2017. Folks with the parents, yeah. or are they living with you? Which one is it? <laughs> um, like both, probably. Like, I'm living with them at home, and then on tour, they're living with me. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to Net Worth Now, where you get to see the lifestyle and net worth of your favorite celebrities. We hope you enjoy these videos, and if you do, please remember to hit the like button and comment below who your favorite celebrity is so we can feature them in an upcoming video. Her full name is Billie Eilish Pirate Baird O'Connell, also known as Pirate and Avocados. She was born on December 18, 2001 in Los Angeles, California, United States, making her around 19 years old at the time of this production. She stands at 163 centimeters, or 5 feet 4 inches tall. Raised in a two-bedroom house in Highland Park, where she and her brother were homeschooled, Eilish was encouraged to pursue her interest in dance, gymnastics, horseback riding, and especially music. Billie Eilish has also confirmed that she has Tourette's syndrome, and that she was diagnosed with this disorder when she was a child. Billie Eilish has been criticized for never smiling in photographs. She has responded to such criticism by saying that she does not like smiling because it makes her feel weak and powerless. She is known for her eccentric dress sense. She is often criticized for it, but does not pay any attention to the criticism. Billie Eilish gave fans a rare insight to her love life in her documentary on Apple TV+, The World's a Little Blurry. Opening up about her very private relationship with rapper Brandon Quentin Adams, aka Q, the Ocean Eyes singer got candid about why they broke up after dating for under a year. Billy is now reportedly dating Matthew Tyler Vorse. Many people previously speculated whether Billy Eilish and Justin Bieber were romantically involved due to their close relationship. You are in your house that you grew up in? or Yeah. Oh, you are? Okay. Yeah. Uh, and your brother it's... lives with you or no? He did until like the end of last year-ish. Billie Eilish was born into a family of musicians and actors. She grew up with her elder brother. Her parents, Maggie Baird and Patrick O'Connell, were popular figures in the American entertainment industry. While growing up, she saw her elder brother, Phineas O'Connell, fall in love with music. Additionally, her mother wrote songs and her father played instruments such as the piano and the ukulele. The musical vibe in the house inspired little Billie to make a career in music. She grew up listening to the music of the Beatles and Avril Lavigne. Her father loved making mixtapes of various artists. She was homeschooled for most of her early years, but that did not stop her from participating in extracurricular activities. She loved acting in homemade films and also sang and danced whenever she found the chance. When she turned eight years old, she joined a choir and sang with them for three years. By the time she was 11 years old, she was already writing and composing songs of her own. She also made several short films. She shot them on a camera and edited them on iMovie, Apple's video editing app. Other than acting and music, dance was another passion of hers. She took dance classes in her early teenage years. With a plethora of skills, she aimed at making an extensive career in show business. Her elder brother had a band of his own. He had written a song named Ocean Eyes and asked his sister to record it in her voice. This accidental song turned out to be the breakthrough success for Billy and boosted her career. As, as cool as everything else is, it's like the Grammys. You know what I mean? Like that's, I've, I've watched that every single year of my entire life. Mm -hmm. Like judging all the girls ugly dresses. The song Ocean Eyes was recorded in October 2015 
It was initially meant for Billy's dance classes. She handed over the song to her dance teacher and meant it to be featured in her next dance routine. The song turned out to be good, and the siblings decided that it must be upon the music sharing platform SoundCloud. The song was uploaded on SoundCloud in early 2016, and by March, the music video was released. The song shot up and registered more than 10 million hits within a very short period of time. This success was unexpected and made way for many more versions. In November 2016, a music video with Billy dancing on the song was released. It turned out to be another success. Several major record labels came ahead to buy the rights for the song. The song was released worldwide by Darkroom and Interscope Records. It immediately became a critical and commercial success. Toward the end of the year, Billy released another single, Six Feet Under. Inspired by the success of her debut single, Ocean Eyes, Billy recorded four remixes of the song and compiled them all in an EP titled Ocean Eyes. All the remixes became big hits and gave Billy enough courage to carry on with her future projects. In February 2017, Billy released Bellyache, which was produced and co-written by her brother. The music video for the song, directed by Miles and AJ, was released in March 2017. Billy then recorded a song titled Bored, which was included in the official soundtrack of the famous Netflix series 13 Reasons Why. Two more singles, Watch and Copycat, were subsequently released. In July 2017, Billy announced her highly awaited debut EP, Don't Smile at Me. Before the official release of the EP, she released two singles from the same, My Boy and I Don't Want to Be You Anymore. Leading up to the release of the EP, she added new songs every Friday. The EP was eventually released on August 12, 2017. The same year, she collaborated with Vince Staples and released a remix of her song, Watch, which was renamed and burned. In order to promote herself more, she embarked on a tour in January 2018. The tour ended in August 2018. She also collaborated with famous American singer Khalid and worked with him on a single titled Lovely, released in mid-2018. The song became immensely popular and made the producers of 13 Reasons Why to buy the rights and feature it in the series' second season. In 2018, she released the singles Bitches Broken Hearts and You Should See Me in the Crown. Like We never missed it, so yeah. the fact that I'm the same, like, little girl watching that in my living room, and then I'm still in that same living room, like, being nominated for six. Like, what is that? Billy is one of the highest paid musicians in the world. Between June 2019 and June 2020, she earned $50 million. A large portion of her income is from her music, but she makes a decent cut from show appearances, ads, and marketing deals. In 2021, she is estimated to be worth $53 million. Billy's LA house expands to 110 square meters. The family got this estate back in 2001 for $240,000. However, now the value of the house has increased to about $800,000 because of Billy's legacy. She still resides with her parents in her LA home and her recording studio in her home have too much sentimental value for her to leave for a bigger home. In her garage, you will find a Dodge Challenger. A McLaren 720S. A Chevrolet Suburban. an Audi Q7, and a Chevy van.